Good morning, everybody. We just woke up. I think it's like six, six something. Um, and we're just gonna go hang out and watch the sunrise. And yeah, overall, it was a pretty good night. Liam slept well. I think he, he woke up once. Um, but yeah, it was a good one. And yeah, we went to bed pretty early too, just to get a good, good night's rest. But yeah. It's such a lovely day today. So we just uh, picked up our, our food from the bear cache and now we're uh, getting ready to, to have breakfast and just uh, enjoy the rest of this morning. So we're, we're just finishing up our, our breakfast for the morning. Uh, just had a, a little bit of oatmeal. It's always nice to have some oatmeal in the morning. Liam loves it. Yeah. It's a pretty then, nice day or morning. It's kind of chilly a little bit, but not too bad. So I'm just about to make some coffee. I'm gonna try this for the first time. I've heard really great things about this. Um, it's just a pour over. So yeah, I'll try it out and see if it's any good. We're just hanging out inside the tent this morning. We had breakfast and then we hung out outside, watched the sunrise. Then we came back in here just to keep a little bit warm. Now Liam's just playing around <laughs> and we might start to pack things up soon and head out for, for, for lunchtime or eat lunch first and then we're gonna head out, so. But I'd say it's been one of like our better camping trips. It's been really nice and there's no one here. So I don't know if that's made it quite a bit better, but yeah. This little guy slept really well too, which was great. Even though he didn't nap well yesterday, we were a little nervous about that, but he did really well. So I thought I'd kind of show you um, the equipment, just a few things that we use. So I have the MEC uh, Delphius negative nine sleeping bag. It's a down sleeping bag, so it's super cozy. It uh, packs really lightly, um, and I love this one. And then I use the Climate um, Insulated Sleeping Pad. This has been amazing and it also packs really um, small. And then Liam sleeps on the Thermo Rest, um, just like a sleep pad. You could use this as like a, a seating pad and then we just use it for him to sleep on. He has the Morrison Outdoors Sleeping Bag. Um, I think this one's like a well, this one's a 20 degree Fahrenheit sleeping bag and it's also down so it goes really small when you pack it which is really nice and he's worn it the last few camping trips and he stays really warm and then Brandon over there has the Teton Leaf uh, sleeping bag I think it's a zero degree it's a negative nine uh, sleeping bag this one's a th synthetic sleeping bag so it's not a down um, which just means that it doesn't compress 
as small as a down sleeping bag, but so far he's really liked it. Um, and it keeps him really warm. We also have just a pillow over there that packs really small too. We just have one, um, just whoever needs it. And that's pretty much it. Our like sleeping setup. Oh yeah, and then Brandon, so he actually has a sleeping pad, but it's actually pretty big, so we left it at home just because we had to carry a whole bunch of stuff. So uh, back in the day, we would just sleep on these like like foam sleeping pads, which isn't the greatest, but he just brought that along for this trip um, until we find like a, a lighter option, like the one I have, but it seemed to work for him pretty good this night so so i just wanted to show you guys how small um liam's sleeping bag can pack so because it's down you can like really get it to go super small We just started using this before when we went camping. He would just use a bunting suit, um, which works really well. But then I discovered um, this brand, Morrison Outdoors, and they make uh, like baby and toddler sleeping bags, and they are amazing. Look at that. All ready to go. So, yeah, it's like really nice. Um, And it's like perfect for like backpacking. If you guys want, uh, we also have a discount code uh, for 10% off if you're interested. Um, we'll write it in on the slide here. Um, the code if you're if you're interested and want to check it out. So for lunch, Brandon's having the pepper beef with rice, and then Liam and I are having the three cheese lasagna. What I do like about these ones um, is that if you don't have like a measuring um, cup with you, it'll tell you um, where to fill up the water. So for the uh, for this one, we just had to fill it up until till eight. So that just helps if you don't have like. A measuring cup or anything like that so we just have to wait about 10 minutes for these to be fully rehydrated so we're just hanging out Liam's just playing here and we've packed everything up already so we'll be headed out after lunch all right we're all packed up and ready to go let's see how it goes So we're on our way back now and as we were leaving i think there were probably at least two other groups of people that um were coming into camp and then as we started hiking back we saw like another three people so yeah i don't know we left we left out i think really well because we didn't have anybody with us um and it's it was the monday the holiday going into Tuesday and we actually thought of even coming the Tuesday to Wednesday which would have been today but it's it's busier so I'm glad we we decided to stick to the Monday
Okay, so I'm just quickly gonna um, talk about the bridge. So this is the bridge that connects the West Canyon Trail with the East Canyon Trail. I'm trying to whisper because Liam fell asleep, but um, it's such a beautiful bridge and you have such a nice view. So yeah, you can access the East Canyon Trail through the West Canyon Trail. I think we mentioned that before, um, but it's super nice. We're about uh, halfway back to the bottom now, and uh, the first little bit was a killer, but now it's kind of flattened out. Uh, Liam took a little nap, which helped a little bit, so now he's got some energy to finish off this trail. Okay, just to kind of help you out, um, when you're walking up here from the parking lot, you're gonna come to a fork that way and that way. You wanna go left, keep going all the way until you reach a sign, and then you're gonna keep going left. Just to let you know. All right, guys, we finally made it back to our car, so we're gonna end the video here. We hope you really enjoyed this um video we really enjoyed our trip so um yeah keep in the loop of, uh, of our videos we're gonna try to do some more back back country uh camping for the summer but yeah thanks for joining us again